Hi everyone, this is Jason here from Nathaniel. Welcome back. In part 2, we are going to basically take the same set of 5 notes. If you haven't watched part 1, do head over and check it out. It's a very important exercise where I've taken a fusion scale and played it on pretty much all the keys. Pretty much all the 12 keys. So you can go over there and watch it if you haven't already in part two we are going to talk about improvisation and very organic improvisation using just your voice and the piano of course so what i propose you do now is practice your left hand to just go what it used to do in part one up and down on this scale which is Sagama Pani Pamagasa flat seven there. One seven one three four five seven flat five four three one. Now how do we begin our process of improvisation? First we need to have the ability to play something in the right hand which doesn't interfere with that left hand right or doesn't stop the left hand so start with single roots maybe a semi brief they all work try to stick on the scale that one but start with simple notes Da, try to sing that da, da. Once you do semi briefs, try to build it maybe to minims or half notes. Half notes. That means one and two. Two notes for every melody. What do you do after half notes? Quarter notes, pulse. If your left hand is paining, take a break from time to time. If your mind is a bit fried up, simplify the right hand. Whatever you want. Develop the process organically. Okay, so now moving forward, also focus a bit on your legatos and staccatos. So if you take like a long note, long follows short. Try that. I am still on the scale. play the scale in different shapes you could go start from the third so that's the default start with this shape start with this shape from A now from C almost Every pentatonic scale, because it has five notes, it will have five five positions. So that's another way to get your improv going. You can whack, st stay on the position and not play what the left hand is playing. Just think of that hand position and improvise only in that region. Very 
versus this shape. Tidurum, tidurum, tum ba ba bum. Tidurum, tidurum, tidurum. with the G position. Start with the A position. The more you jumble the notes, you know it's going to sound a lot better than the C position. So far we've done two basic improvisation techniques and hand independence at the same time where you try to graduate your speed of rhythm, rhythmic notes where long, shorter, shorter like that. Go to the pulse, then go sub beats. Then we looked at the idea of hand positions which are five for each scale, especially the pentatonic scale in this case. The, the next thing I'd like you to do is bring in your voice. So what I propose we do just for a few uh, moments in this uh, lesson is I will try and sing something and then we will try and play that together. Okay, so this will be a constant. I'll try and sing something and sing it for a bar and then play it the next bar. So if I do da -da 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 -da, play revise that on the key now copy see fingers are all over the place so figure that Sometimes it's either your fingers acting up, wrong finger position, or the other concern would be you just can't get the rhythm of what you sang. So either the notes or the rhythm could confuse you. So it's a great way to get better as a pianist. See, I forgot what I just sang. So let me try and sing something else. Doesn't this sound like that smoke on the water or something? Right? Anyway. So if you like a rhythm or if you've ripped off something really famous as smoke on the water, milk it for all it's worth. what's happening eventually is I'm singing and I don't even know what's coming first. It's becoming a chicken and egg situation between the voice and the piano. It's almost like given an option, you'll sing with this voice or you'll sing with this voice. So you're trying to make the piano more part of you, you know. So, so sing. Ta -da -de -do -do. Try to match that perfectly. It's not easy. So it's going to take you some time to match it. First try and match what I'm doing. Let's wait longer. Ting, ting, ting. Play Tessa, memory also out, if you ask me. At least my memory. Now I'm making mistakes because it's tough. I've slowed that down, right? Din, 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 din. 
See, I could get that in the right, but I struggled in the left. So more practice. Got that. Some weird dotted stuff. So. You may be able to catch that, but executing that with this left hand is the is the hurdle. That's why we are piano players. We have chosen this profession. So. I like that rhythm for some reason, so I'm gonna now milk it. So. This process can go on and on. So I'm just going to do two things before I conclude the lesson, guys. For part one, first of all, we did all of our um, finger exercises and so on. Part two, we looked at these improvis improvisation ideas. First off, playing long notes, then getting into positions and then being able to sing and catch what you sing. So what I'm trying going to do at the end of this part is I'll just... Or try and sing something and keep it as simple as possible and leave the space blank. So you will have to kind of uh, fill in those blanks by playing exactly what I have sung. So yeah, you need to focus and you may want to rewind fast forward to that point uh, even in a later stage. And there is more. We have a Patreon page which has a lot of the assisting, supporting media for all of our lessons. So what's going to happen is you're going to have those recordings waiting for you there. You're going to have the notation waiting for you there. You're also going to have the MIDI waiting for you there. So those are 10 fusion melodies which I've composed, which will definitely help you. So I've taken some time, I've composed it, I've notated it, and we've put it all on our Patreon channel. So two things to remember at the end of this. Do consider progressing this exercise on Patreon with more uh, defined 10 fusion exercises and now we are going to basically copy what I sing so I'm going to sing then I'm going to keep absolutely quiet and then you have to play okay again I'm going to sign off before I actually play the stuff so thanks a ton for watching the video your support to our channel means a lot leave us a comment with what you thought about the lesson and what you'd like us to cover in the future and give the video a like a share and don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell So Ta na na Ta na 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 Ta na na Ta na 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 La da 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 da. One more time. Di 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 do La da da. One more time.
na 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 Bam bam bam.